Hi guys. If like me, in these current situations, you're spending more time at home, you're probably watching more and more TV. I know I am. The problem I've got at the moment is, is I'm running out of content to watch. In fact, I think I'm even putting things on Facebook, asking people for recommendations on what to uh, try and screen and uh, keep myself occupied. You guys are probably doing the same thing. The format of the series, docu-series reality show, is performing more than others. Everybody loves a series. It gives us time to bond with the characters, and from a studio's point of view, it gives longevity to products and productions. At Warrior, we have realised that, and after nine big British films executive producing, we've now stepped into this format. On top of that, what we've also done is set up, over the last two years, a listed film bond. This gives mere mortals like yourselves the opportunity to invest into a marketplace that is outperforming all others. Netflix, amongst others, have over £15 billion a year to spend on new productions, and we want to slice that market. We have a strong slate of productions, I believe, which include John and Light, who's actually in Fear City, very successful on Netflix. We've got Big Phil Campion, Massive Character, X-22 SAS, Paul Gascoigne, Gazza, his life story. And we also have Bruce Compton, very successful series called Combat Dealers. And last but not least, we have the Page 3 Girls. That's Linda Lusardi, Sam Fox, um, Jilly Johnson, to name a few. So if you receive the information, you can go through this pack and have a look at our ideas for the next 12 months, 24 months. Going back 10 years ago, when I got into film purely by accident and film finance, cinemas were still making money and any new release was released through the cinema. That's now changed, roughly about 10 years ago, Netflix launched. And they launched the video on demand subscription format. Five pound or 5.99 pounds a month goes out of your account that you don't even see, and it gives you access to a large library of new content and the series. We have good relationships with all the terrestrial channels and digital channels over the 10 years of building our company. And we want to try and exploit the current marketplace, which is no longer cinema and new releases. It's the digital format and the subscription format. Over the last five years, we've seen many, many companies. We've got HBO, we've got Disney, we've got Facebook now with The Red Table, um, along with Netflix and Amazon, all offering libraries for a small subscription charge. Ten years ago, if a studio made a production, they could go to Netflix and present, and Netflix would give them an offer a take it or leave it offer. Um, and apart from going to the terrestrials, there was nowhere else our production studios could go. That's changed. Competition is rife. Netflix, Amazon, HBO, Disney, Facebook all want to retain their subscribers and at the same time add quality content to their portfolios to keep us watching. We've realised this marketplace and we want to take a part of it, as I've said. So, over the last two years, we've put together a listed film bond for investors. This gives you guys the opportunity to invest into Warrior and the next two or three years' worth of productions. We know we can make an episode for around 50 to 70,000 pounds. And we know the sort of figures that the big boys will pay in order to secure quality good content. And believe me, it's three or four times that. So if you produce a series of six episodes, you can see how profitable this could be. We've joined forces with Exito Brand Consulting and Andy Richings in order to raise this £5 million in the bond to produce the content. The bond offers 8.25% paid annually. Sorry, it's not paid annually, it's paid quarterly, but 8.25% a year. And I don't think anything else can compete with that. This arena is growing massively and we want to be part of this and we want you guys to be part of it and reap the benefits. This is a long journey. It's not just about putting five or ten thousand pounds into one production. You're actually hedging your bets. You're investing three or four products at the same time and if one fails, there's a good chance, there's a very good chance that the rest will perform. I hope to see you at one of the many premiers we've got planned and I definitely would like to see you make some money with us.